This door. I think that's where we're supposed to go. There really isn't any other place to go. And, uh... Well, here's another part of their operation. Whatever it is they're doing. Now, walking along this... Walking past this guy is very important. Because if you don't, he'll kill you. He'll shoot you. Because I guess running just isn't allowed. And, uh... We'll gonna put our gun in this baking soda because I I guess baking soda is really good for hiding guns pick this up and head on over now this guy's gonna search us but because our gun is white bread yeah thanks because our gun is hidden in our boxes All right, you cool Baking soda, he won't find it. That's the thing about Hitman, they they search you, but they don't search your box of goodies, so there's that. I can get the money, sweetie. It's as good as mine already. Mr. Spook's got it. We'll open the park. It'll be like old times. No, no, just a few more days. You gotta believe me. Don't say that, sunshine. Mr. Spook's gonna come true, baby. He's good for the money. I won't sign the papers. I won't. You gotta give me one more chance. You gotta. Baby cakes? Sunshine? Hello? You know, I'm starting to think that this guy's better off dead. And this unlucky fellow is going to get his throat cut. Come on up, join the party. And as he's twitching there on the floor, I'm gonna grab his gun and head on, head on down. Oh, here's a fuse box. Uh, fuse boxes and Hitman do things when you break them. Let's see what this one does. Oh, the lights went out, what a surprise. And now, no one can see us. And we could just sneak on by, but honestly, yeah, that's much more fun. And, uh, whoops, here's another guy coming. But, you know, I don't think he could even see us, so... <clears throat> yeah. Well, no one left alive. Awesome. What awaits us next in the bathroom? Let's see. Ooh, here's a new gun. Let's pick that up. Like they say, the longer they come, the longer they piss. I never I say that. Die, That's man. disgusting. And now we have a human shield, and we won't have to worry about getting shot. And... I never noticed this before, but when you reload, when you have a human shield, he actually pins them to the ground. Didn't really get a good look at that, but, uh, yeah, no one left alive. I'm gonna pick up these guys' guns, too, because why not? You can never really have too much ammo. And no, 47, put that down. We don't need that. Let's stick that in our coat, in our very large coat, and head on up here. It's, uh, it's been a while now, uh, Scoop, and I was just wondering uh, where we were on the whole money thing. Were you? Yeah, see, the thing is, if you remember, you know what we agreed to was, it'd just be a short while and you'd pay in cash and... and uh, I know the what the pressure was you were under must be, but the deal is a deal, and I was hoping, you know, maybe you could just pay what we agreed on, even though you've been here for, heck, more than twice as long as we agreed to, but, but just pay the original amount and move on. Not right away, necessarily, but, you know, I'd appreciate it. No. <laughs> oh, 
Yeah, I'm starting to think he's definitely better off dead. And shortly we will oblige that, but first we gotta snipe some people. <clears throat> well, let's see. Three sniper guards. Three guards. You're dead, friend. You're dead. Let's zoom in on this guy. Uh, I didn't go for the headshot there. And here's the last one. I always have a hard time finding this guy. Or at least I used to have a hard time finding him until I played this level over and over again in anticipation of a let's play. So let's put away our toy. We should always put away our toys when we're done playing with them. And head on. Now, I'm going to keep this rifle with me because in Hitman, when you leave a level with w new weapons, you can use them later on. So that's going to be useful for, for future levels. <coughs> I'll pick up his gun, of course. Can never have enough. Can never have too many bullets. <sighs> fried dough. I love fried dough. I uh, might head to the park before the summer ends to get some, actually. And here's a poison syringe, but we're not going to use it. Sorry about that. Well, I'm sh we'll use the poison syringe plenty of other times. Uh, sneak up here. Depends who's unwrapping me. God damn, girl! I'd have your fine ass unwrapped before you could say. Who's that handsome stud on time I river? I bet you could. Oops. That's Uncle Joe. Better get back to your post. And here's the funnest part about Hitman is pushing people off ledges. <laughs> Goodbye, buddy. It really is the most satisfying way to kill people, in my opinion. And the game's telling us to poison this lady's drink, but honestly. I don't see a reason to do that. Uh, instead, I'm going to hide in this closet like a pervert and see if I can't knock her out without her seeing me. And here's where she would die if we had poisoned her drink, which I did not. Huh. Wonder what she's drinking. Is that Coca Cola? Is it shit water? I don't know. Uh, and she saw us. Darn it! Come back here, you, so I can knock you out. Oh, uh, you know, at this point, I could just let her go. But I mean, she's still gonna be a witness because she saw us. Um, yeah, whatever. Oh, hey, a fire extinguisher. This gives me an idea. I'm going to put that down, pick up this fire extinguisher. And let's head on into the next room and talk to the Swing King. Who the hell are you? How'd you get in here? Carol Ann! My client has hired me to show you this photograph. I don't understand. My client has asked me to ensure it's the last thing you ever see. Please. Look at the photograph, Mr. Clarence. And now we're gonna put him out of his misery. Goodbye, buddy. <laughs> um, that noise is really annoying. Uh, let's get our rifle back. Here we go, rifle suitcase. Oh, for goodness sake. Shut up. Let's see if we can put an end to this sound. Shut. Ah, oh, it's bulletproof. Jeez. Who gets a bulletproof phone? Man. All right. Let's head through here. And we're almost done. Uh, here's our last toy for the level. The, uh, the remote mine. Very useful in Hitman for causing quote-unquote accidents. As we will soon see. As soon as we walk on through this window. We got an intruder scoop. Some motherfucker busted in on Jay-Z's watch. You know, I don't like uninvited guests. 
Now we take out our detonator. And let's just listen. That guy just killed one of his own men. That's not nice. And now he's begging for mercy, which is kind of strange because he just took out his gun. Um, he's supposed to be an enemy, not like a civilian. Begging for mercy is kind of weird. Uh, hey! He was just pretending. That sneaky bastard. I'm going to break your mirror just for that. And I'm going to get your Desert Eagle, too, because the Desert Eagle is really cool. Oh, please, lady. I'm not going to hurt you. And there's another Desert Eagle in case you kill him before he takes it out. Player. Player uh, pinball machine. And why not break stuff? You know, we're almost done with this level. And... I, yeah, I don't know why I did that. Whatever. Let's, let's exit. And here's the newspaper portion where it changes depending on how we kill and how many people we kill. Now, we killed 26 people, which earned us deranged slayer. Hmm. Now, well, I guess I need to be more accurate when I shoot. Although I thought I hit most of my targets when I shot, so, huh. Well, oh, who's this guy? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, that's it for Let's Play Hitman Blood Money. I will see you next time.